Hello everyone, today I'll be showing you how to get into Hyrule Castle easily and safely from Central Tower. So first you want to scope out any guardians, and there are guardians dotted around Hyrule Tower, but this direction over into this grove has not too many guardians, so what we're going to do is from central tower just glide straight on and when the guardian's about to fire you want to drop down like that and use a the shield these are the only guardians you should have to worry about and they can't move and then if you've got DLC, use your master cycle. If not, then we'll just have to walk. I'll show you it as if I've not got the DLC. So you'll just want to walk through over to this forest. Here we are on the map in Passari Green Belt. And we're going to go into the quarry ruins. And there's a little entrance near the first gate house that we're going to take. There is a better way in through the back, but I'll show you that in another video. Doesn't really matter how you get in. This way is more fun. So just make sure you're facing towards quarry ruins. Not too far. There is a shrine down there that I've actually not got yet. the guardian it misses us this is the dangerous part avoiding these guardians go quickly and dart from side to side should enable you to get past them pretty quickly we're just at quarry ruin so we're going to run it into it got Yiga there as well for the most part, just ignore the user. They're not going to be any trouble. Just run through. There's no safe way through the front, really. The back is the better option, but this is the way through the front. And we're in the centre of quarry ruins at this tower. You want to go in here. We've got a chest. This is our first chest along the route to get you some bomb arrows. You can see, and we're going to keep going in this direction. I would definitely recommend having all your. Um, Divine Beasts. Pre-con, so, um... Before you do this. Um, you can deflect the Guardians, so it's dangerous. So I recommend just running or riding your horse or whatever through her. <laughs> Going to use a volley scale to get myself out of the danger. You can do that as well. 
If you have that shrine, of course, you can use that to teleport to. But once you're here, we're going to make our way over to the secret entrance. We're going to glide over using a bow, not using a paraglider. And it should be that door at the bottom, I'll show you in a second. Here's our second reward, that's the door we're at. Second reward, change to remote bomb. Either them blow up these luminous stone rocks. And then we're going to change to Magnesis, which I'd recommend getting out before you go in. If you have Xanth's helmet, I would recommend equipping it. There is a chest here, should have a diamond in it which is your third piece of loot on the way in and the cooking pot in which you can light if you want to you can apply to it here as you can see this is why you need Zant's helmet but we're just going to go through here hopefully we need we need to drop just remember you need to drop a metal item so I'll drop my golden claymore and you can use this to the roof protection is now ready to roll. push your cart along not the easiest thing to do though so I'm not sure about this, but you get your bombs down there, you can detonate them, send you flying along, this is the faster way to go through the minecart system get you to the end of the minecart system. This will drop you out down here next to a corrock and some hard boiled eggs. You need to put an egg in the final hole to get the corrock and then you can collect your hard boiled eggs and you can heal up in the hot spring. But from here, and there are some more eggs, and there might be some ancient parts at those guardians, so I'm not sure. I hope you're enjoying this tutorial, and if you do, make sure to subscribe. It's a risky way in, but quite good way in. That part is a dead end. Um, well, I'm not. Let's see on the map, where are we? There might be a secret passage through here. I'm not sure. It's not a dead end. I don't know how I didn't see that. Then the secret passage, which you might need to bomb open using your remote bombs. It should be all cracked. Um, can get you into the main passageway, the Pyro Castle, easily like that. And here is the high knocks to get your skeletal high knocks to get your Hylian shield in these tunnels somewhere. Great. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this tutorial of how to get into 
Hyrule Castle from the front. Appreciate it if you subscribed and watched a few more of my Zelda videos that I will upload in the future. It's the way up. Bye.